and we are back to the game that killed Midway. Now, if you noticed at the end of the last episode, it jammed near the end, although I did manage to get the beginning part through, hopefully. Now, how that level ends is just a helicopter lands and the screen fades black and then it cuts to three years later. So I'm just going to load that episode. Shut the hell up, game. This episode. Oh, you could, can choose those individual things. I thought it would just start you from the start. Anyway, let's play the game. So we so when we last left off, we left Summers behind because Noah is an idiot. And we're... And everyone's sad about it. Even after three years later. And there's one of the things from the cover art of the game. Though we actually don't see him in this level, we see him in the next level, so that's a bit of a spoiler. Nevada! Thousands of people gathered in the nation's capital today to protest the upcoming military draft. Draft? What is this? A Vietnam? Well, then again, it's... Ooh, I can turn my head all the way around! I'm like the girl from The Exorcist! <laughs> Wow, this guy looks like eh, happy to be at his job. Get that damn thing out of the way! You're holding up the traffic, you hippie! And, to, and we, being the super awesome military guys we are, we set up our base at a frickin' gas station diner. Yeah. Oh well, that's kind of clever, actually, I guess. Do they actually do that in real life when there's, like, a national threat? They just set up shop at a local area and put up a bunch of tents and stuff around that? Oh, here's the Presley! Hey, I'm on TV! Hi, Mom! Hey! Why are you wearing a bulletproof vest? Do you go into, like, Los Angeles frequently? What kind of answer is that? It's the only kind of answer you're gonna get. Ooh, military burn, bitch! Come with me. And this is our Colonel, Green. That's his name, Green. Yeah, real original. And he gives us a long-ass boring briefing. Been a security breach at Detachment 3. I'm gonna turn this up a bit, hang on. Center. Perpetrators unknown. Important material in that base. Vital to national No, it's not Area 51. Area 51 is in New Mexico. We're in Nevada. This is completely different. Definitely not Area 51. Despite the fact that it's in the bloody title. He looks a bit pixely. You notice that the shadows and stuff. Stop pointing at me. straight into the base for a stop. Get get away from me. We launch a full scale assault. We actually don't go to the base until the end of the game even though he's explaining it to us right now. Oh yeah, that looks like a flight test center. No aliens there. We've ordered all civilians within 100 miles to report to base camp. Now most of you agree to ride the storm out. Fourth Infantry entered the town of Rachel, Nevada for final sweeps at 14. Mm -hmm. We lost radio contact with them 30 minutes. Then why are you sending in like my just my squad? Go to Rachel, reconvene with Fourth, assess the situation and report back to me directly with your finding. God, this guy looks hideous. Are you sure you f you should retire? Stop looking at me. Stop following me around. I'm hiding back here. Piers. I never had a chance to express my condolences about Summers. He was a damn good soldier. <laughs> it's never easy to lose someone. Yeah, and that, yeah, it's very coincidental that you're mentioning Summers right now, three years later. Hey, shut up. Oh, and there's Grayson, our steroid-bound friend. It's been a while, dog. Come on, time to prep up. How'd you like Colonel Green's briefing? Blah, 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 wah, wah, wah. Yeah, whatever. What's wrong with your eyes? They look like they're trying to escape from your head. Hey, partner. Little surprise for you. Noah's here. <laughs> oh, damn allergies. Oh, great. Noah's here. The bitch who left Summers behind in the first place. I'm not sure this isn't a coincidence either. I'm sure this is a coincidence too. <laughs> I've been waiting for you. Come over here. Uh, have, I'm not. No, I'm going to look behind this counter first. Oh. Ooh, new computers. Ooh, and a Dodge Nitro! Yes, really. You'll see that in a second. They can hear us. I have to be quick. Give me your arm. Ass! Get your hands off me, bitch! He's an idiot. Either that or he's delusional. Well, he's creepy, that's for sure. I have no idea what's happening out there. Remember Iraq? That's Iraq? Why we're both here. You're being sent in without an... Being sent in without an... Anti-venom? What? What? Are there going to be snakes in Nevada and you're not giving me anti-venom? Skin cover. 
Well, it's kind of hard because I ha my uh, forearms exposed. Atmospheric readings just came in. We're registering a mole count seven thousand times higher than normal. You mean seven hundred? No, ma'am. I double checked. Bring me a sample and put on a face mask. Yes. <laughs> Take a closer look at that gun. No, you're not going to tell me more about this? You're, we're alone again. Uh, screw you, you're worthless. Ah, Co-Store! Ah, Noah, help me! 5,799! Yeah. Oh. 5, hey, buddy, your rifle's moving on its own. That's probably not very good for you. Dude, Noah gives me the creeps. Straight up. No, she's still not as creepy as Colonel Green. Dear God, that guy looks like a zombie. I've been like this all day. It's hurricane season in Nevada? Global warming. Yeah. Let's go find out what's going down in Rachel. Hey, when this is done, let's go to Vegas. Make some money, watch a game at Caesars. And probably get... Nope, nope, I'm not gonna make that reference. That's, t that's too much. And we got a freaking airfield up here that we somehow... Did they just construct this airfield when they set up base here, or was this here before? Come to the gas station diner, where we have a freaking airfield right next to the damn... Uh, b diner. Well, I wouldn't say airfield, it's just a helipad. But it has giant hangars near it. And giant freaking fuel tanks, too. And here's Ambrose. Once again, not wearing his helmet. let anybody in this dump. What's up? This is Janine. Just turn two. Wait a minute, I thought that was a little girl. That was a dude. They're saying it's some <laughs> that's gone off the deep end, but I don't know. You don't move. Are you talking to Ambrose? Why are you looking at me? Yeah, who knows? You feel like driving, Pierce? Shotgun. Sweet, we get to drive a car. And I would also like to note <laughs> this is our vehicle. They aren't letting us take that over there. An actual military car that that sometimes has a machine gun on it. That one probably has a machine gun on it. And you're giving us a cannibalized civilian car without doors. Are you trying to get us killed? You're sending us into a hostile location with just a civilian car. And also, I would like to add, this is a Dodge Nitro. I'm not kidding. They actually call it a Dodge Nitro. Not only in the game, but also the strategy guide. Where they actually have to put a copyright symbol next to it every time they mention it. Pretty sweet. This game was probably just intended to be a vehicle to launch the Dodge Nitro. And and the Dodge Nitro probably died out because of the, the boringness of this game. Because we see billboards for this thing everywhere. And actually see one in a parking lot later that Ambrose... Did the game just jam? Uh, nope, thank god. <laughs> That Ambrose points out in a parking lot later in the game. Well, I will admit, it is kind of fun to drive. You don't have it for long, though. <laughs> Seriously, why would you give us a civilian vehicle? What the hell's wrong with you, military? Echo squad. We've had some unseasonable Speaking of which, aren't we Marines? We're Marines. Why, is it, why are we doing on-the-ground stuff? Shouldn't this be a job for the National Guard? Hey, yeah, whatever. Put on some music. No way, talk radio. Anyway, it, it controls the same way as Halo. You steer with the camera and stuff. And if we keep an eye on the sky, we s might see something. Hint, hint. What's that say up there? I can't even read that! Why would you put, put up a billboard that you can't even read? Handbrake. He's listening to some guy. Hey, what's up with this draft and stuff? Oh! What the hell was that? You'll find out later in the game. Anyway, let's keep driving. Before they pull it, okay? You're going into slavery. We're all going into it. Is this the place where Wiley Coyote lives? This looks just like it. Wiley Coyote lives in Nevada. Anymore, man. Come on, turn it off. The bridge is out. And the roads are for shit out here. Yeah, like the levees in Nam. Wait a minute, what the hell? Wait a minute, you are in Nam? You're way too y old, young to be in Nam. D stop lying. Alright, so there's clearly a rock slide, although I highly doubt that rock slide would destroy a concrete bridge. But then again, everyone in the comments is probably going to correct me on that. Who left all these flares here? Was there someone here already? And oh my god, that semi's on fire! Someone died in this rock slide! Where are the ambulances? 
God, this state sucks. No offense to anyone who lives in Nevada. And so we drive down this river bed like in Crash Band, like it were in Crash Bandicoot or something. Hey, and we can smash these cactuses. Fourth infantry. Yeah, suck it, cactuses. That's for pinching me all the time in Minecraft. Base camp. This is Echo Squad. Do you have any choppers in the area? We're getting buzzed. Yeah. Over. What? The? Someone Echo. dumped. Colonel Green. That's a negative. Someone dumped a sofa in this river. Ow! Oh God, that helicopter's shooting us. Damn, Who the hell would? You ask birds. Who the hell would drag it? Someone dragged that all the way out here and left it. Why not just leave it out for the garbage men? And there's another one! Well, who keeps leaving couches out here? Oh yeah, we could return fire, except we don't have a gun that's on this thing, you shriveled up prune! God, I hope this records. I got some good stuff in this one. Shut up, guys! We aren't gonna die. I can tell, because we're gonna go up here. And there's just some random military dude who... He's taking us a, a large amount of bullets. Oh, he's dead now. Because we, cause, cause we can pick this up. Solve this problem. Just like Mr. Rogers would say. When you have a problem, solve it. And the best way to solve a problem with an enemy helicopter is to shoot it with a giant frickin' missile launcher. Oh yeah, we can reload this too. By replacing the entire two. Let's get out of here. We can figure out who that was later. Oh yeah, we also start with a pistol on this level. I'll show it to you on the next mission. We're, we'll keep using the rocket launcher for now because it's it's kind of fun. Yeah, here it is. I think it's meant to be a Mark 23, although it might be a USP. I don't know. <laughs> All these creepy ass trees. Is this what it's like in Nevada? <laughs> There's another. What the hell is that? Does he have. Ow! Oh god, we're getting jammed in the rocks. Okay, no. And there's a civilian car, so we're not the only ones who tried to drive down here. Yep, that's another rocket launcher. Are they just giving those things out? <laughs> Whee! Oh, looky here! It's one of these things. Well, that's not malicious. Check it out. Nasty. What do you think it is? <laughs> Whatever it is. We didn't tell them about the things we saw, so so they don't know because they don't know what this is because we clearly didn't tell them. Oh, oh no! It's the suicide bugs. And what? Roaches bred with prize pigs. Yeah, eat shrapnel, bitches. I should really stop saying bitch. That's, that's really not unprofessional. Anyway, let's get back to driving. Now we have to avoid these things while we drive. Oh no! <laughs> drive for your life, fools! Can't you guys can't just lean out the window and shoot them like in Saints Row? You probably have seat belts, or did they take the seat belts off too? God damn, the U.S. military is cheap. Just like those douchebags in the AU, Gonzetta Gundam. They made some perfectly good mass production mobile suits and never used them. Probably due to cost concerns. And there's a dossier up here that we could take. But we don't need it because I've unlocked them all already. Just driving along, trying not to get blown up by some suicide bugs! Oh, crap. That was close. There's some more of them. Drive in between them like an action movie. Yay! And it's a bad day to be from Nevada. <laughs> no lie, man! Sometimes I get lost, I don't know, when on this mission. Although that one other road was probably a dead end. Rachel, Nevada, 7,000 miles. Yep, this is Nevada Extraterrestrial Highway. Ha ha ha, get it, because it's all aliens. I know, who cares. And unfortunately, we have to say goodbye to our Dodge Nitro. Goodbye, Dodge Nitro. You are an awesome car. My dad loves you. Ooh, 
Ooh, what the hell? Apparently there was a command post here, and we've never apparently lost contact with them too, because everyone's dead, even though they had machine guns. Yeah, definitely not going to be an ambush here. Open this damn door, you slackers. What are we busted. Let's get it open. <laughs> dude, dude, I'm just going to look this way for no... Oh, dear. That was inevitable. Look alive. Up the road. Oh, dude. Ow! Watch it, jackass. Ugh! Thankfully, these things are really easy to kill because they have huge freaking heads and you can just blow them off. And there are machine guns here, making it even easier. So let's kill these alien knockoffs from the movie Alien. Yeah, this is for root for uh, not continuing that story from Prometheus, assholes. Instead, you just went somewhere else. When your allies have high morale, they toss grenades more frequently. I think I mentioned that before. Man, I didn't sign up for this shit. Yeah, you did. The army owns your ass. Ooh, porta toilets. Uh, at least we get a ride with guns. Yes, I'm glad we do, because the military sure as hell wouldn't give us a ride with guns. No lie. Hey, did Colonel Green mention any of this creepy crawly shit to you, I wonder if you could walk all the way. You probably could, although it would take a freaking long time, and I can't do that during this Let's Play. Maybe I'll do that for a special video one of these days. <laughs> speed limit 70. Who cares about your speed limit? We're the military, bitch! Damn it, I said it again! Ooh, oil rig. Homeland security. It looks like an accident. Someone hit the guardrail. Oh, for crying out loud, just... Around it. <sighs> All right. Dumb assholes, they can't... Cr Why do they always crash in pop culture and they make it harder for everyone else? It's just like that dumb little girl from Night of the Leap. As she ruined it for everyone because she made the giant rabbits. Oh, crap. What was that? Oh, more suicide bugs. Nice one, sir. You blasted it. The pistol actually does more damage than the assault rifle, and you could fire it as fast as you pull the trigger. Although the assault rifle is a lot easier to use because you could just hold down the trigger and you don't have to keep pressing the trigger 5,000 times. Doop -de -doo, I'm sure nothing bad's going to happen here. Oh no, it's a worm. Good thing I cut that. Those are called flatheads, but I'm going to call them graboids for humor purposes. And also, some asshole was c making, f called me, told me to fuck off when I, uh, on one of my Marvel Ultimate Alliance videos. Dude, I'm trying to be funny, alright? I'm not trying to play professionally. Go screw yourself. Anyway, back to the game. And these guys just teleported. Ow! Fucking tanker trucks. And we're going to get attacked by more graboids! Who die in like a couple of 50 caliber shots. Oh dear! That's not good though. Those things do a lot of damage. Shoot the ball, you dumbass! The slime balls. Of doom! Oh crap, there's one right beside us. Go, 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 go. They are so terrible at shooting these down. I oh, forget, I'll do it myself. Dumbass. And more flatheads. Okay, the recording's still going good. I don't know why it jammed that last time. I'm hoping that that won't happen again, because that was really annoying. I almost broke my computer from uh, doing that. No, oh, I'm sure nothing bad's going to happen here. Of course, I've made that joke several times, so of course something bad's going to happen here. Let me at him. 
It's a giant one! He can survive more than one rocket! Oh noes! Uh, two rockets! Nope, he can't survive more than two rockets. And since we can't get that car over there, we have to leave it behind. Although it's not too big a problem, because there's another one right here! Jesus Christ, these guys are leaving these things lay around all over the place. Seriously, they didn't have a shortage of these! Why didn't they just give us one of these from the start? And more suicide bugs. Haha, <laughs> get it, because they're on the road and... Ah, screw it. Little al alien. Haha, <laughs> that's a terrible pun. You should be ashamed of yourself. Should be reaching a checkpoint soon. And here it is, the alien. Hey, if we can get this guy to open his garage up, we can cut through. How do you know we can cut through to the other side? Have you been here before? I doubt it. Anyway, let's just abandon that again. And we're going to get another one later. Man, it's hot as hell out here. Shut the hell up. Runs this place and get back on the I'm your commanding officer and I order you to shut the hell up, you dumbass. He won't care if we cut Why, you little station. bitch? Clear. Hey, he has these creepy alien do toys that we're going to kill because I don't don't trust them. Here's some trucker radios. Open the door, dumbasses. And there's some trailer trash guy getting attacked by aliens. You guys kill that thing. I'm gonna use this to kill some another one. Assist local civilian. In this trailer pl place. And we're out of rocket launcher ammo. Eh, well, that's fine with me. Ooh, ice gold squishy pop! I want some of that! Bash it open, I want some! Give me some squishy pop! What the hell? Ah. Oh god, their mouths open like the Predators from that one movie with that gu Royce guy. What the hell's wrong with you? You looked like you were an Enderman. Notice that my gun has two... I probably pointed that out already. I should stop saying that. There's some more of these things. You notice that this game isn't that hard. Yeah, that's probably one of the reasons. Ooh, propane. <laughs> hey, leave trailer trash man alone. Over where? Are there more of them? Stop distracting me! We have a mission to do. Open the frickin' door. Open up! You guys US? What do you think, dude? Sir, it's alright. Just tell us what you're doing. What am I doing here? I live here, son! This is my gas station, and these boys are tearing it all to hell! I thought this was an end. It's Marine Corps. 85 to 89. Is that how old the Marine Corps is? They on, they've only been around since the 80s? I highly doubt that. This guy probably didn't get much schooling. You if any. Do something about this mess? Sir, the situation is under Negative. control. Like hell it is! This country's under attack. This is just the beginning. Yeehaw, let's just shoot all these dirty commies in the face. Whole platoons of them. Battalions, even. I seen three of them this morning. Full armor, biggest guns you ever seen. Yeah, we're going to see them later, don't you worry. Moving in formation. Killed them all. Margaret, Bobby, everybody. I like the way he bobs his gun up and down when you look up and down. Get easy, man. I think you hit the hell I did. I'm telling you the truth. Ah, oh my god! I'm going into the basement and I ain't coming Normally it gets stuck through the window, that didn't happen. Also, one time while I was playing this thing, this guy was just standing outside with his arms outstretched, like he was frozen. I'll open the garage. You can get your rig out and cut through to the highway. 
And there's another one of these things. I doubt that's the same one. They probably just spawned another one in so they wouldn't have to do additional work. And we're out of here. Yeah, good luck with whatever you're doing here, douchebag. We're out of here. Smash through this ranch door. I carried it all the way through Iraq. Kick ass American engineering, baby. Hate to break it to you, but those are mass produced in China. Does that really happen? Does, does China really make 90% of our weapons? I highly doubt that. When does this game take place? It probably takes place in 2000-something, since we have, like, computers and stuff. Coalition of the Willing. And we've hit a checkpoint. And, for, and because of that, I'm going to stop here for the day. It looks like this recording's going well for once. So when we come back, we're going to meet these heavily armored, biggest ass guns freaks we've been hearing so much about. And probably get the Rachel. After a lot more driving. I mean a lot more driving. So I'll see you then.